Sonic Frontiers has been out for almost half a year already. With new DLC and a sequel coming in the future, this game hasn't really been thought about in a while. And with this being the final episode of the four-part series of Sonic Frontiers, I will take on the final tasks to destroy the final boss. And while I'm doing it, since this island's not really that entertaining, I'll give my review on what makes this a good game and what to stay away from in the sequel. Sonic Frontiers. The Sky Voice has tasked us to destroy six towers on Ray Island which is really just Kronos Island's other half. Will he be able to take on the Sky Voice once and for all? If that's what's going to happen, that's my prediction. I mean, it's kind of obvious, but we're, we'll see. Now, okay, well, seems a bit tedious. While I'm suffering at these platform sections, let's talk about the islands. Kronos Island, the very first island you inhabit. It's a very large grassy mountain range with lots of elements of the past lives of the Coco. It's a beautiful island with a waterfall and its stunning structures. The guardians here are good at giving you your first challenges in the game, where you can die easily and not know what the heck they do. The puzzle in this area really gave me a hard time trying to figure it out. I mean, I took 30 minutes to get it right, and I guess there is Amy to talk about? Who am I kidding? There's nothing to say about it. Oh, I made it. Hello there. Looks like you are shut down and you're gonna collapse to the ground. Or just stop. We have to do more platforming to get to the platforming segments. Ares Island, a very large open desert. The land here is dynamic and still poses a threat when you get lost in a maze section. I love deserts and this place really does scream, I'm a barren wasteland! With its lack of life, greenery, and all the artillery cannons here. There was an area with lots of greenery, which was a nice touch to get you out of seeing only one color palette of brown and tan. Fear is rising, but it's time for me to face my fear fear. No! This area's guardians are a bit on the underwhelming side, where you loop around rings to kill, grab onto a tail for 30 minutes to kill, spend 10 minutes figuring out how to effectively shoot sumo into electricity so you can kill, but Tank was the only one who really gave me a challenge saying, fear me, our first encounter won't be the last, because without knowing what to do, you'll die. This area's puzzle was by far the hardest thing in the world. Match the colors? I can't do that! I'm just kidding, it was really easy putting the green, purple, and orange orbs in their spots. What? And Knuckles still is himself. There is also nothing to say about him. I'm gonna hyperventilate. Oh my gosh, we made it. Ah. Ah. Earth? Ert. Oh. Oh no. It's encased in darkness. Spaceships. What the heck? We're gonna die? What, was that just a fancy way of getting down? Oh, that's nice. A shooting star. I don't care because I have 999 purple coins. Chaos Island. What a change in landscape. It's a volcanic island surrounded by mist and completely covered in ash. I think. This place was much harder than the other places, constantly making me confused on where to go. There are some interesting formations around the island like the green limestone-like area, an icy mountain top, and these hexagonal rock pillars that look really cool. Ah! Oh hey, I'm actually sweating. Don't tell anyone that. The Guardians took a step up. Well, most of them. There are two new ones like Spider and Fortress, but there are also slightly altered but duplicated forms of past Guardians. Except for Squid, he's exactly the same. Spider is by far my favorite Guardian, and the theme is awesome. The puzzle here is a pinball game. After all the chaos and crazy stuff on this island, we're greeted with a pinball game? Sure, it's a nice change of pace and has something to do with the story, but I'm just confused. Tails finally realizes his full potential and is going on his own path to have his own series of games. Not really, but at least we can play as him in the DLC. Made it. Imagine falling off on that top part right there <laughs> because you didn't make the landing. The Chaos Emerald is detecting something. Giganto? What? <gasps> oh no! Oh no! Sonic's destroying the protection of the Earth against the Sky Voice. That is definitely what's going on. Rhea Island. Or Rhea. Or Rhea. Or Re. The one we are on now. It's a nice large foresty area, and it's the other half of Kronos Island. You can go back to the place where you fought Giganto, which is awesome. Anything else to say about this place? No. This has to be it. Ah, I've done it. Here. We go. We're all gonna die. Sonic's fault. We all knew this was gonna happen. At least I didn't. Well, I didn't know. What? The last titan in space. The sky voice. No, the fourth titan. I don't know what is happening. No, you can still do this. Why did we destroy them? They must attack. Go. They clearly fail though because the titans 
are back at Earth. Whoa, Persona 5! Sonic, don't die! Oh no, he's corrupted, but he saved everyone. Now we have to play his tails. Sonic, no! <laughs> Amy, stop it with that run. He took on so much cyber energy, it corrupted him. Meaning? He's stuck between realities. No! <laughs> okay, somebody shoot him. We can drive back the corruption and bring him back. Yes, Sonic heroes, but for Sonic. Sonic, we're even after this. <laughs> Oh, man, I didn't move enough. <laughs> the oh, no. They went inside of Sonic, and now Sonic is living again. But they died. Now we have to team up with Eggman. Let's do this. Oranos Island. Oranos. Ar uh, uh, this is Oranos Island. Or Oranos. Oranos. Or or it's a very large island filled to the brim with guardians. It has a nice flower field as well as some cool land formations. There are even separate islands and extended areas which you can cross over by jumping on this invisible wall. This is the only island where you have to get six of the Chaos Emeralds through vaults. This place looks totally rad. Let's go. Whoa. Puppies. Hi. Oh, angry puppies. Ah. Uh, oh. I, stop it. D okay. Dog. 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 And dead dogs. No, you stupid dog. You made me look bad. Hey, Sonic. Would you like to try? I'll let you borrow a rod. No, Big. I don't want to try. You know why, Big? Because every single time you give me that rod and I pull it back, I lose money in my bank account. And how do you get all of this stuff? Like, where did you get Eggman's memos? What, did you, like, go to the black market to go find those? And why are you selling children? You're selling lost children for a price tag of three tokens. You have to be kidding me, Big. There is something wrong with you. How do you get the children? You make me buy these lost children to return them to their family. How many do you have? Oh my gosh. Caterpillar. I mean, that looks more like a hermit crab. Okay. Uh, jump over. Through there. Stop it. Let me... Excuse me. You want whatever. Thank you. Siloop. Yes. Go. Kill him. Yeah! Many Sonic frames have killed you. Hey, nice to see you. I wish you could say the same for me. Every time you see me, there's always peril going around. So let's collect some more vault keys. Would you like to try? I'll let you borrow a rod. Sure, whatever, Big. I don't care anymore. I'm just gonna spend all my money catching whatever fish comes out of this lake. Even saltwater fish, which doesn't make any sense. Man, look at that. We catch one of the oldest fish in the book. Kanoichi. 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 You're crunchy either way. You think that... Okay. Wasn't expecting that. Okay. I was expecting that that time. You ran out of tricks up your sleeve. Would you like to get silooped? I could freely siloop you and kill you. Have a nice flight, loser. That thing is huge. Looks important. It's not, so let's go. Key? Key? Please? It's a key! <laughs> the green chaos emerald. We've never got that one before. Fishing's really good in this game. I mean, the fact you can just buy everything here is really good. Because Big the Cat's black market deals. He's got everything for the cheapest prices. Everything that's really hard to get, Big will have it for you. Including lost children. But we don't talk about that. I hey. Oh my gosh, the Olympics. I'm gonna grab it. Come here. Yes, Knuckles is back. Uh, I, why did I skip it? Anyways, hey, can you give me some good stuff, please? Nice. 81, 80. Um, increase that by 4 and 3. Almost to 99, but still have a long way to go. Now, let me just save these lost children of yours. Wow, you gave me a thousand children. 
You gave me a thousand and twenty children. No way. Big, you're crazy. How did you even get this many children? Silver hammer. I said I would come back for you, and I will. Ow. Okay, he seems to be pissed. Not as much as I am, though. Dead. Your hammer wasn't strong enough. Four vault keys, plus an additional three, and the cyan light blue chaos emerald has been unlocked. Fine sage. Okay, glad I got all the things I needed, finally. I wish I came here before I actually beat the game. I'm recording this after I beat it, just to get the fishing segment. You know, I need to cover- oh my- Gosh, what the heck? Wow, all of that for a gold card that I don't even need. Hey, Sage. Glad you're here. <laughs> Please take these. Do you know how to activate the starting device? Maybe. I figured out everything else up until now, haven't I? Don't sweat it. Yeah, you just have to wait until that happens. Okay, time for some typing and editing. Are we hacking again? Got it, 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 Fun. Yeah, thought I lost. I'd like to take this little time to thank Wild Dragon for supporting the channel. Your support means so much to me and it really encourages me to make more content for you guys. Fishing is a very good part of this game. It really helps you get your ranks up so much before you actually fight the final boss, which I don't recommend doing. You don't want to be too overpowered for some bosses. You can learn about the story of the game before it even starts. Like me, on Kronos Island, I bought all of Eggman's memos to go hear what he was saying, and then I found out that the Cocos are descendants or relatives to chaos. Now it's gonna shoot a laser. Told you. And build a bridge, I guess. Man, technology is so good at building things. That one was kind of 3D printed, so we kind of already know how to do that. Not impressive. Oh, two things at once. Whole map is conquered. Yes. And Chaos Emerald. The white Chaos Emerald is here. I believe that's four other Chaos Emeralds. So that means we got a total of six. And that is all of them. Yeah, see? Zero. Whoa, wow, big. Can I keep this one? Oh no, of course, you don't let me keep any of my caches. It's all yours. This could probably sell for millions of dollars. There it is. And here we are. The green Chaos Emerald is in my grasp, right? Now, and now our task is to get the Chaos Emerald again. Would you like to try? Shut up, big. I just want to buy stuff. Give me more of those children. Wow. Big. How do you, how did you get this many children? Big, I'm a little bit concerned. Uh, how do you have over 3,000 children in stock? Big, big, it's not stopping. What do you do on your pastime? Don't think about it, big. Don't look around. Tell me, what do you do on your pastime to get 4,000 children in stock? Big, don't look at your rod, big. Big, answer the question. Where did you get the children? I'm not Sonic, I'm Santa. You gotta tell Santa if you've been good or not. Now, have you been good, big? No. Oh, well, okay, good enough for me. Oh, hey, Chaos Emerald. You're with Sight for Sore Eyes. You represent Tails, and now you are with me forever, Tails. <laughs> Big, I'm scared to do this, but I gotta buy the children. How many do you have? What is going on with you? What on earth made you decide to get this many children? Elder Coco already said that they're like children, and you have over 6,000 of them. Big! Why is it not stopping? Where are these flow of children coming from? What is going on? That's it. I'm gonna go tell Elder Coco what you've done. Come to me! We are almost done. We got this. One more is acquired. There are just two more. Collect- eh. Memory tokens. Okay. How many more do you want? F 68! This is going to take a very long time. 
Well, that's not gonna be fun content. I'll talk about the cyberspace levels, which is equally worse. Chronos Island cyberspaces. They were pretty simple. I was thrown off by the 2D ones and getting the hang of certain obstacles. 1-2 was the hardest one I had to face, but I beat it in the first video. Definitely not the first try. I knew that if I beat that one, I could beat all the others. Ares Island wasn't bad, and so is Chaos Island. Chaos Island did have the level that drove me nuts because I needed to know the ring dash, and I didn't. But here, let's just say it wasn't fast enough. I'm so sorry. I am retrying. Yeah, that sums it up. There are four titans in the game. One for each island, not including Rhea Island or Re Island or whatever it's called. It's just Kronos Island. Giganto was a fun boss with a design I never would have thought to see in a Sonic game. Look at his teeth. He was pretty powerful and overall fun to fight against. The Wyvern, the Wyvern, the Wyvern, having to catch up with him is a pain. You miss a double parry and boom, you're back to chasing. Once again, they have crazy designs and I love it. The cutscenes were epic with Sonic throwing it into a mountain? Like, no way, bro! Knight was a cool boss. With his four legs of leg day and pulling a sword out of his skull, he deserves that name. Sonic went full out kill mode on him, pulling out what I can only describe as a better Sonic final smash on this colossal robot before he decides to end it by slicing him in half with his own sword. Pretty rad. Okay, okay, this one's right here. That's it! That's it! I did it! I did it! Okay, let's go, 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 go! I don't need 11 more, I just needed that much. Thank you. Use your power to start the system. Hurry, our time is limited. Yes, let's go. My time is limited, too. There better not be any more crap having to get something to save, you know. <laughs> yeah, we could just do this. Whoa! Oh. Ow. Oh my gosh, somebody play Megalovania. No! Dang it! No. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh, it's the final boss. Oh, go! Yes! Oh, we defeated Sans. Last Chaos Emerald. It's right there. No traps or anything. Ah, sixth Chaos Emerald. Give him the key and come into my hand, please. We are reaching a conclusion to this, and now there will be a cutscene. One more. I gotta hurry up. You're not fast enough, so I found it for you. Go ahead and beat that giant. Now why would I want to disappoint you? Drops it, breaks it. Oh yeah, here we go. All the best fights happen at night time. Now it's up to this boss. What will it be? And how epic will the fight be? Here's the final titan arises from the ground. We will destroy it like all the other ones. Oh my gosh, he's got a gun! Supreme. Supreme, alright. Ow. What do we do with those? Oh yeah, take that. We get hit just from something. Ow. I'm sorry. Oh yeah, have no defense now. Oh, here we go. Teeth crunching and... Yell. Here we go. Your ang- Oh my gosh. He's got wings? What the heck? Okay. Yo, just get him. Yeah. Oh. Go, 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 I don't- He's- Oh. Oh, I, I, okay. I know what to do now. I gotta take out all those side things. I, I will do it. Ow. Oh no. He's gonna shoot us. Ah! Bam! Wait, did he- sh did he shoot us through or something? Or the gun? He's dead! Wait. I'm not over yet, Sonic the Hedge. I- I'm not done. I still am here. Don't- uh, never mind. I'm just gonna fall asleep now. Ow. I wouldn't be surprised the last guy is in here still. Oh wait, no. Sage is gonna use it. Oh no. It's emitting electricity. Okay, it's just gone. Is that it? All we did was chase it out of its shell. It's retreating into space to regain its true form. Oh no. Even Supersonic won't be able to stop it. I know what I must do. I must... leave you. 
Well, there go. Whoa. Super power Sage. Here we go. Thank you, Sage. Oh, he's going back into space and supersonic for everything nowadays. Be careful. Dear daughter. Heartfelt Eggman, but... You know what, you're still a jerk. We are in space! And is this the moon? But that's the moon. Oh no, this is the creature. The end. Here we go, I guess. Light shot. Oh. You have served your purpose. No, I don't think we're done. Now face your no, 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 no. You're nothing. You're nothing. Mash. Mash. I don't care what you're saying, I'm mashing, and I have no intentions of listening to you. Ah, I'm losing mash control. This is kind of hurting now. Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! I don't know what you're saying, and I do not care still, so please just shut up. Ooh. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Whoa! Sheesh, we're fighting like a planet, and I don't know what to think about this. When do we get into the punchy punchy stuff? I really like to do that, you know? This is taking so long. Gosh. Oh my gosh. I, I got- I got- I got this. Yo! Super Sonic style, and Super Sage style! Yo, Super Sage would be really cool. Oh no! I'm gonna die. I know I am. I'm sorry. You can't- after attempting again and again, the game gave me pity and gave me three lives. And as I expected some super awesome Sonic fight, all we get is Sonic spending 40 years to fly through this planet, only to have Sage take care of it and sacrifice herself. And Sonic doesn't even care. He doesn't even go to thank Eggman for helping him or to comfort him for losing his daughter. I'm torn on who the real enemy is here. And with all that said, this was Sonic Frontiers. It may have had an anticlimactic ending, but it's only leading us to something else big. And I want to know what that is. If you enjoyed this video, please consider subscribing so you don't miss a new video. I don't normally ask for stuff like this, but it really does help support a small channel. Thank you for watching.